That is a really unlikely and out of character shot. 46. I'm so surprised that he didn't get in behind the red. He kissed it on the way through. He'd be disgusted with that shot. Oh, there's an awful lot of frustration there. Ronnie O'Sullivan, 46. <coughs> He's got as good a control, I think, in those situations as anybody. It was a shot before that really hurt him. One. Well, we talked about the clearance John Higgins made to win the Masters against O'Sullivan 2006. Got a chance to make another one here to really take control now. Not just, obviously, with the scoreline at 4-0, but psychologically as well. Six. O'Sullivan frustrated there. The shot that he played Seven. previously. Nineteen. Nineteen. Gradually getting it back into the frame, whether it this becomes a frame-winning chance. Depend on, I think the red, well both reds actually are difficult, but the one down the table. They've been going in along that bottom cushion pretty well this week. Not always the case. <laughs> well, he'd be quite happy with that. 24. Okay. He's screwing back for the blue here. He'll... Be aware of the importance of finishing top side of it. Without that, I don't see how he can get on the red. It finishes straight. Well, he's done it. He's done every part of that shot perfectly. 25. He's just a bit thin, actually, on the blue. He'd like to be just a tiny bit straight. Obviously, better control, but I think he probably has to play it and just drag it in, I suppose. Is he really thinking about the cannon? Shaped up there like he was looking to cannon the red out. That's a very difficult shot to play. But he got behind the red. I think he'd have potted it. As I say, they've been going along the cushion nicely. Sullivan's still in the frame. John Higgins, 30. Still in the frame, maybe, but in a pretty nasty snooker. Of course, free ball. Is the worry here if he misses the red? Foul. You miss. John Higgins, seven. Well, he has left a free ball. Free ball. I'm sure it's much help to him that the red and the black are where they are. He may just have them put back. 
See if he can gain some kind of an advantage from playing the free ball. But the red and the black are completely locked up there. Back, yeah. The black on his spot, Marcel. I think that's got to be the right decision because I don't know that he can win the frame where the ball's ended up. But of course, the Sullivan's still in this difficult snooker. Okay. If he hits it, he could leave it, and then the red and the uh, remaining colours are there. Thank you. Good job. It's perfectly replaced. It uh, could be worse, but of course uh, there is a chance that John will go for this red. I think he will go for it, and it offers tremendous value. It goes in. take the yellow and the yellow again because the yellow is uh, yellow spot is extremely tied up probably would go on that and hardly be potable anywhere so up and down the table of course doesn't want to be straight Eight. Oh, that's okay that is probably perfect won't need the pink which is awkward Ten. Well, a couple of oohs and ahs there. The uh, yellow not clean, but it's gone in. Well, this is to land a real hammer blow, isn't it? To win a frame where O'Sullivan did have a chance. He was in the balls. It went wrong. One of the few chances he's had today to score. But John Higgins misses the green. Now, how big a moment could that be? Yes, and he's really disappointed, as you can imagine. I think he, he played it that way to hold it. He tried to pinch the pocket a little bit. Could have easily gone Three. from the bolt cushion up for the brown, but he chose to hold, and that's why he missed it thick. And of course, Ronnie O'Sullivan does need the pink. Won't uh, need the black though. Seven. Mm. The angle is not perfect. He's got to make sure he doesn't get too much side on this cue ball. It's coming the other way round, playing it in the bottom. Well, not to see how he could have knocked the, the pink out. I don't know what he played there, actually. Surprised he went that way. Huge moment. Biggest moment so far in the match. Pink and black left in frame four. Three one or four nil. Sullivan needs pink. Higgins needs pink and black. Most difficult shot to keep safe. Ronnie O'Sullivan, 12. And really, that's all he could do. Bit of a nothing shot, but that's just the way it was. Didn't want to leave a, a double to the middle bag if he hit the, the pink thinner. What a shot. What a double that was, Dave. Well, absolutely. And he's on the scoreboard. That's the important thing. It was a bit of a scramble. John Higgins may reflect on the green he missed, even though he's in front. You just feel there's plenty more snooker left to come in this one. So at the interval, it's advantage John Higgins leading Ronnie O'Sullivan 3-1.